The objective of this game is to untie a large rope knot located in the middle of the field. Both teams have infinite respawns. First team to untie the knot and bring it to the referee wins. I'm also going to do something I haven't done in over two years and commentate over this footage. Now my subscribers will notice that uh, this video is much lighter edited than most of my airsoft videos. It's just been a really long time since I uploaded my last airsoft video. I've got a lot of footage to go through anyway, and I just kind of needed to get something out there. I did go outside for a brief bit, but our team had already taken the outdoor portion, so I just went back inside. Also, looking over the field right now, now seems like a good time for Jason and I to move up to the objective in the middle of the field. So we're gonna do go ahead and do that now. Jason, come here. Jason, over here. You see that green triangular cover? I'm pretty sure it's up there. If you can move up. Okay. Oh, there's a guy moving to it right now. Where is he? Just move to it, I'll keep you covered. When airsofting, it's always important to move slowly because there's so many corners that people can be hiding behind. The slower you move, uh, there's a good balance. If you move too slow, it's easy for you to get flanked, but if you move too fast, it's really easy for you to walk in front of someone who's guarding a corner. Jason is on the other side of the wall I'm leaned up against here, and he's Yo, currently other side. I think there's a guy on the other untying team. a knot. Around the corner. No, around the corner of your building. I'm not sure if there was actually an opponent there or not. Okay. Dude, Jason's working on the objective now. Hey, someone cover the left side. I'm looking directly towards the enemy spawn. Or I was, now I'm looking at their side. It's a wheel, it's not a person. Jason, how's that? What the shit? Are you freaking kidding me? You have to untie that? Ref, that knot, yo. That's one hell of a knot you got there. I'm impressed. I'm not going to be able to do this. You got plenty nice of time, pun by Jason. Jason. Not gonna be able to do this. Hey, you got some advancing left side, left side. There was an overall time limit to the match where if neither team completed the objective within the time limit, the match would end in a draw. Yo, how's that coming, Jason? Problem with the sniper rifle, you get so far out of cover to use it. Yes, there was someone using a bolt action sniper rifle at the indoor He's field that day. On. The funny thing about using bolt action sniper rifles indoors is it's actually more effective than you might think you because there's the no the windage and all the shots taken are at pretty close range. So if you're good at aiming your bolt action indoors, you can actually land most of your shots. Although that certainly doesn't mean that people are going to call their hit at an indoor field while getting hit with just one BB. People often tend to not call their hit in the indoor fields unless you spray them down with Yo, quite a few BBs. on the left side, let me know. All those people calling hit are teammates, so I was assuming there was going to be a rush of enemies from the left side. The teammates that were there seemed to have held off the enemy that took out the rest of the team, though. Come on, Jace. Mission Impossible time. And time's Mission getting close. Time, and Jason looks like he's almost got it untied, hey, yeah. so it's going to be can a close one. This with another 30 seconds. Can we get into like overtime since we're completing the objective? Team Fortress 2 logic. Oh, 
Oh, sorry, shit, sorry about that. I'm really sorry. I was expecting enemies to come from that side. That was a teammate. I shot him because, like I said, I was expecting enemies to be rushing towards me from that side, not a teammate. It was just a reflex or knee jerk reaction to shoot him. The ref. The time may be over, but the ref didn't call game up, so game's not over yet. Jason, just run it. Finish untying it while you're running. Jason has got it untied. Jason, run it! Or, he pretty much has it untied. Jason, run! Now, the objective of the game run, was Jason, to untie the knot here. and bring it to the ref, who is the guy in the red shirt there. Bring it to the ref! But Jason, Jason brought it back to our base. Run. Come on, man. I'm counting it as a win because if Jason had been paying attention to the rules, we would have won. Should we just call that a win? That was huh? so Can we just call that a win? <laughs> Come on. <laughs> it was close. We win. I don't care. It's going down as a win or not. Yeah, Jason, what's your problem, man? You're so freaking Please slow. Alright, guys, clear it. Take out your mask. Out of that I have or what? No idea. How intense that was? Bang, 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 bang. Bang, bang. Sorry, I got to shoot you because you can only bang out two at a time. I hit fire that too.